Good morning. Welcome to another vlog. I'm so happy that you guys are enjoying this type of content because I really am enjoying it too. I have my coffee brewing, but I also am going to make myself a liquid IV because I feel so dehydrated right now and I have not been drinking enough water. This one is the Tarte Green Apple Powdered Probiotic Kombucha Drink Mix. And I do have an affiliate code which does get y'all a discount. And if you use it, you can stack whatever sale is going on on top of my discount. So right now I think it's like 20% off the website plus my like 15% off. So it's a really good deal if you shop through the website website. I'll leave that link in the description box. These are so good. So now I have my drink for hydration and my drink for energy. I just put a little bit of creamer and some oat milk in my little espresso shot. This blue one is the one that I drink. It's just the Starbucks roast one. Espresso roast. I do end up needing like two of these, but I don't like the bigger coffee pods because I like iced coffee and when the bigger one gets watered down if I like add ice to it. So I just do one of these, two of these a day. Here's what I'm wearing to pick up Jace today. I do need to throw on my hat and my shoes. It's definitely a no makeup day for me. I really need to work out, so that's why I'm wearing my workout outfit. And I'm also gonna run by the post office to return those Abercrombie jeans. I was able to exchange the size 29 in the baggy 90s fit for a 28. And then I'm just gonna throw on these white Adidas. Brayden's wearing the tie-dye t-shirt that his best friend made for him? Yeah. And we are all ready for school pickup. Let me see your outfit, Ellie. Ooh, cutie. <laughs> yeah, so I just have some basic jewelry on. These little lock earrings I love. They're from Amazon. And yeah, I got this hat at Marshall's, I wanna say, or Ross. I am wearing my Lululemon dupes. Ooh, we have packages. Oh, dang. Dang, we got a lot of packages. Um, you don't need to throw them. Well, look at my sunglasses. Ooh, Ellie got her little Target sunglasses on. I ordered these, turn to the side, turn your head. Ooh, they look good, Brayden. Let me see. I ordered two of those kids sunglasses. Cool, it came with a case. Jace's were supposed to come in today, but they're not getting here till tomorrow. We just got home, so I figured I would unpack all of these Amazon orders I just got in. Look how cool that is. It is Jace's new lunchbox. They have these in a whole bunch of different colors. He really likes neon, so I went with the neon yellow one, but they have blue, red, I think a black one. How cool is that? I did get a whole bunch of Amazon brand clothing. I am planning a Amazon fall outfits video and then a dedicated Amazon brand. Let's move this out of the way. This is like a little ribbed midi skirt. It's more like a maxi on me. It goes down to my ankles, right above my ankles, but I feel like when I put it on, it'll get a little bit shorter. This one, Amazon Essentials. Cute little basic puff sleeve white top. It has the stretchy wristband. I thought that was cute. Oh, this is a cropped little hoodie. It has a really cute little neckline over here too. I have this in the mint color already, but I wanted it in black. I like that it's kind of like a high low. This is not Amazon brand, but I did want a pair of just like plain black little sweat shorts. Super cute. I did get a couple Amazon brand PJs. I love my Target ones and this one honestly feels so soft, just like the Target ones. I grabbed it in the orange color, but they do have a whole bunch of other really cute colors. It's more of like a burnt orange UT color. This is like a little plaid button up. 
super soft with the matching little boxer so shorts. This one's a little bit thicker for the winter time, which I like because I like warm PJs, obviously, but I don't always want to be wearing pants to bed. So I like that this is a thicker, warmer fabric and it has pockets. I did finally end up ordering one of these slick sticks. I call it a slick stick, but it's basically just a hair wax stick. This basically is just hair wax. You just put it on your hair to get your flyaways down, or if you like slick ponytails, this will definitely help you with that. And then in this box, I got a two pack of oil diffusers because I got all of those RXLA oil fragrance drops. I've really, really been loving these, but I wanted a couple more like decorative diffusers. So I found this one. Oh, it comes with a little water cup, which I appreciate. They're both exactly the same, but I thought they were so cute and more decorative than the one that I got. They also light up. How cute is that? Let's go set those up. I'm gonna put one of the diffusers over here at the back of my kitchen. I'm not sure where I'm gonna put the other one yet, but I just got some water and I'm gonna fill it up. I think I'm gonna do white tea this time. I had been doing wild grapefruit back here, but I kind of want to change it up. I do have two other fragrance oils. I'm just gonna do a few drops. We only need a little bit. And I'll just keep that right there together. Okay. Pretty. I'm gonna do three hours. Ooh, it's working really nicely. There's where I put the other one. I usually get ready here every day. So I thought this was a good spot. In this one, I did the everything scent and I did a little purple light. I love it. Here I am at 5.30, just now getting around to my workout. Even though I don't want to, I'm forcing myself to. I know I'm gonna feel better afterwards. This is the video that I chose. Y'all know I love Selamar. I went with a full body 30 minute hardcore hit workout. I figured that would be a great great way to get me pumped up after not working out. That was a really good workout. I sweated so much. My face is so red, but I'm gonna come into the garage and do this little vibration plate. I got this on Amazon and I like to use this to cool down. It's supposed to help with your joints and cellulite and things like that. I paid less than $100 for this. It has a remote. Play. And then I'm gonna do this to cool down. You wanna get on? Yeah. <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> Good morning. Today I'm having to run out and go shopping for an outfit for some family photos that we're taking. So hopefully we can find something that matches in Josh's size, the boy's size, and you know, I'll probably do like a white or tan dress for Ellie. I have a couple tan dresses that I'm thinking I could just wear nude and match all of them. I actually washed my hair a couple days ago and I have not styled it. It's just been up in a ponytail. So I do want to curl it today. I got a couple of comments of you guys asking how do I style my hair. Like, I really don't do anything different at all. So I'm just gonna show y'all what I use and just the quick, easy way that I curl my hair every day. I'm gonna start off with this Marc Anthony Grow Long Leave-In Conditioner Spray. So I just spray that throughout my hair. I think mostly y'all wanna know how I get the volume, which is this volume powder, but I do that at the end. And then for heat spray, I'm gonna just use this L'Oreal Boost It Blowout Heat Spray. I get this on Amazon. Just because my hair has been pulled back, I'm gonna run a brush through it just really quickly. 
So now I'm just gonna part it where I want it. Then I'm just gonna take my dry bar curling iron. This is the three in one. And I just used the, I think this is a one and three fourth inch barrel. But I just start in the front, grab a little section and curl it away from my face. I like volume in my roots, so I'm gonna get pretty close to my roots and start the curl from there. And I just do like a vertical part. I don't part top to bottom. I feel like that takes way too much time. So I just start with the top layer and I miss this middle layer, but as you can see, it's like the vertical part. And then I sectioned it into three sections. So now I'm gonna go to the next vertical section and then I'll start on the top, curl it. Let it sit. Then I'm gonna go to the next part of that vertical section. The bottom part of that vertical section. If your hair is frizzy or wavy and you do need to smooth it, just run your curling iron all the way down the strand, smooth it out and then curl it. I'm gonna do that all the way to the back half of my hair. And there is one side done. I'm just gonna take the other side and curl it away from my face as well. Just using the same technique. I would say that took me about like three minutes. So now I am fully curled. I'm gonna go in with this Orbe dry texturizing spray. This is pricey, but it's totally worth it. And I've been using it since like Christmas. And I still have a good amount, I feel like. Now I'm just running my fingers through my hair to break up those curls. I'm gonna go in with this Sexy Hair Big Powder Play Light. I like this one. It's a couple more dollars more expensive than the Got To Be one. And honestly, I like both. I would totally recommend both. But this was on sale during Prime Days. So I wanted to try a new brand. And then I'm just gonna do it on the other side as well. Okay, and then also right here in the back. And this is what's gonna give me all the volume and lift. I'm gonna go in with this Eva NYC Just Glisten Hair and Body Shine Mist. That's it. Now let's go change. Here is my OOTD. I just have on this little chiffon top from Amazon, my favorite Walmart shorts, my studded slip-on sandals from Amazon, and this checkered bag from Walmart. And all my jewelry is always Amazon. I am back. I found exactly what I needed at my first stop, which was Ross, and a little bit more than I was actually looking for, but that's okay because I found some cute stuff. For the photos, I was able to find matching shirts for Brayden, Josh, and Jace. So there's the one in Brayden's size. Jace's size. These were $8.99 for the boys and then a long sleeve version in Josh's size. His was $14.99 and they are exactly the same. Like even the florals on the inside, exactly the same. Major, major score. I did also find this little skeleton t-shirt for Brayden. Look at the skeletons, they're dabbing. I thought that was hilarious. This was $3.99. I did also end up finding a cute little hoodie. It's like a lightweight cotton hoodie for Brayden. 
That one was $10.99. They were also putting out all the Halloween stuff. So I grabbed this guy. How cute is he with the gold rose and top hat? I love him. I couldn't leave him behind. This was $13.99. And then Brayden picked out this dragon skeleton. This was $8.99. And how cute is this candy bowl? It's a Mickey Mouse with the jack-o'-lanterns. I thought that was adorable. This was $12.99. I did also come home to some PR packages from Kiss and Kapari. So let's just go ahead and unbox them. I'm so excited for this one. They are coming out with a new Lash Couture line. Ooh, they are so pretty. Look at that. This one is the style Hot Couture and it's like a 3D mink lash. This one is really pretty too. That one is Avant Garde. The last one, Preta Porter. It says that they are hand woven faux mink lashes. Look at that one, so pretty too. There's some other goodies in here. This is their Lash Couture Clear Lash Glue. They also sent out a black lash glue. This one is in a squeeze out too, but it says that it's 30% stronger. It has a soothing oat extract. I'm excited to try this actually. A little compact mirror. I'm gonna throw that right into my makeup bag. I unboxed a Kapari PR box the last vlog and I've really, really been loving their exfoliating scrub and their body scrub and their milk lotion. So I'm really, really excited for this box. They've become an instant favorite. I love that. It says heal, hydrate, meditate. And this is a selenite crystal known as a healing crystal to promote calmness and mental clarity and well-being. This is their moisture whipped ceramide cream. It says protect and hydrate with this light as air whipped texture that layers perfectly under makeup and sunscreen. They also sent a Kapari eye mask featuring soft touch fabric to block out distractions and everyday stressors. You can get it at Ulta. I'm really, really excited to try this. This is what we ended up deciding on for the photos. I have this tiered maxi dress. I need to steam it, but I thought it would look good with this color color combo and then the guys are gonna wear khakis. It's perfect because Ellie's dress has the tan buttons. I got this at Walmart by Wonder Nation. It's so cute and she's had that all summer. This one is Amazon the drop I want to say. Yep the drop i love it so much it's gonna look good i think i'm about to film my amazon fall haul but i'm hanging everything and ellie's in here playing with me so i figured i would hang and steam with y'all how cute is this set i've been wanting one of these for a while of course i got it in black brown maxi dress brown plaid corduroy plaid button up. Of course I need multiple plaids every season. Cute little mesh, basic ribbed soft sweater, super cute little plaid skirt, bell sweep top, leather shorts, satin dress. I'm just gonna style pieces that need to be styled. I mean, obviously these two go together. A dress is basic. This dress is basic, just some heels. But for this one, I was kind of thinking about trying to dress it up. So I'm gonna grab this white little cropped tank. And I have a skirt that I think will be cute with it. We're just gonna try it. If it doesn't work, then I'll pair it with jeans. This one I wanna do something kind of fun with, so I'm gonna pull that. This I'll probably do with jeans. I was kind of thinking about doing this one with jeans too. I pulled these vintage flare from Abercrombie for this one. And I'm thinking about like a snake print booty. This one, do I wanna pull white or black? I kinda wanna pull black. I'm thinking about these. I think I might do these with this skirt. So 
Like I want to put these two together because I think that will be cute, but I want to make a different outfit for this. I think I'm going to do these with some black jeans. These are my Walmart No Boundaries ones. Today is like the best day to film this video because it's been overcast and kind of cloudy outside. Don't get me wrong, it's still like 95 degrees, hot as heck, but it just like looks like fall. This one, I think I might end up doing with a black top. I think that is so cute. This is one of my Classy Network tops with the built-in bra. Love these. I wanted to do something practical, wearable, so I pulled this two-piece workout set. I got this in a two-pack with a brown one from Amazon, of course. So I ended up pulling these leather Abercrombie pants for this top because I'm so obsessed with these. I think I'm ready to film. I feel like this week has just turned into an unboxing vlog. I wanted to show you all these sunglasses. How cute are they? And they came with this little string. I guess I shouldn't say cute, I should say cool. <laughs> Cause I feel like everyone has these right now. So I wanted to share those. I just went and grabbed my little model. <laughs> Look how cute those are. Do you like them? Yes, I do. They're cute, huh? These are the ones I got Brayden. Here, let me see. Are they dirty? Do we need to clean them? Raiden's are like a reddish, green, yellowy tint, and Jace's, here, let me put it closer to the camera. Jace's are like a blue and green, so I just wanted to show y'all the difference. And I got me a new pair of sunglasses. I came across these on Amazon and thought they looked so high-end. Look at that, with the fade lens. They're so cute. I'm loving these. They had a whole bunch of different colors and I wanna say all of these were around like the $13 mark. I also got in a FabFitFun, so I figured I'd unbox it. I'm really excited for this FabFitFun because the custom was so good. I think I ended up buying this from the add-on sale. I've been using these microfiber towels for my hair. It's supposed to help your hair stay healthy and with breakage while it's wet. I also did add on this Dominique Cosmetics Creamy Fill and Define Lip Liner. The color is brown sugar. I like that it's like a triangle shape and I'm really into this brown nude color. That was a great find. They did include a glow recipe, watermelon glow pink juice moisturizer. I do currently use the watermelon glow toner and serum, so I was really excited to try the moisturizer. For a customization, I also chose these Fry boot socks. I actually got a pair of these last year in a FabFitFun and they are so soft. They also included Fenty this time, which this is the Stena lip paint in the color Unbutton. Okay, so that swatch was a little watery. It could just be from the heat. I shook it up and it's a lot better. It's supposed to be a matte color, so let's just let it dry down for a sec. This is the Dr. Brandt Hydrating Essence Tone Soothe Revitalize. I've tried the Dr. Brandt Microdermabrasion. I get them a lot in the FabFitFun and it's really good. I think I'm gonna keep this in here in my beauty room to apply right before I do my makeup. Some Lumify. I just put some of this Lumify in this side. What do you think? Is it working? I feel like it kind of did. I'm also gonna keep this right here in my beauty room. And then the last thing that I ended up getting is this NARS blush in the color Orgasm X, which they did have color options, which I think that's why this is the X. It's just a little bit darker for more tan skin tones. There's the color, it's absolutely gorgeous. Let's just a little bit on. 
Can you believe I got this in a FabFitFun? I also got my PMD in a FabFitFun, actually. A full-size PMD in a FabFitFun. Needless to say, I love my FabFitFun. So pretty. I'm so excited that I got this. So there's that Fenty color, and it did go pretty matte. I think it'll be so pretty with that lip liner. I just ordered the NARS foundation the Natural Radiant Longwear and the Radiant Creamy Concealer. I'm wearing the foundation today, not the concealer because it just came in today and I got this one in yesterday. Since I'm unboxing, I wanted to share a couple pairs of shoes that I just picked up for Jace and Josh. Jace needed a few new pairs for back to school and I thought those were so cool. They were on sale at Foot Locker. And then Josh has been on the hunt for some black Adidas. And I ended up finding these at Nordstrom. I love the brown and white sole with the black. Hit the thumbs up button if you had fun hanging out. I think next week I'm gonna do a weekly hair vlog so you guys can see how I style my hair from when I wash and blow dry to throughout the week. Cause I usually go about like four days without washing my hair. So I think a update would be nice cause I have been getting how to style requests so I figured that'll be helpful. I'm also gonna be decorating my house for fall soon. So stick around and hit the subscribe button so you don't miss that content. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye.